Hello and welcome to the Gage Look, and please join us in the Empire of Man in Stellaris. Now we have all the most up-to-date DLCs with maybe the exception of one of the species packs, but I don't really care about that. Now guys, we're going to do a roleplay campaign here. Now you have to remember, if you've got my previous Stellaris playthrough, I am terrible at this game. Truly, truly terrible. This is our homework. Yes, thank you. Truly terrible. So... We are going to play quite militaristic, hence the Empire of Man. But I might be shocking. And I've not played the newest update, is it Apocalypse? I've not played 2.0, it could all go horribly wrong. But let's just get involved anyway, so... Nothing looks like it's changed too much here. A this science is our ship. science ship, which is used to survey astronomical... Why are you giving me tips? Is this because of the new... Must be the new data. Okay, science ship, have we... Do we already know all our own? Okay, I didn't think that was the normal case there. Okay, if you can go survey system, destruction ship. You're already annoying me, dude. Um, okay, Titan. Can we go build... My Mining stations here. are used to extract the minerals and shut up. Okay, if you can build a mining station. What am I doing here? I'm already being ridiculous. Ah, okay. There's already a mining station. What? Alright, oh, there is. I am ah oh, my god. What a start, guys. What a start. Build mining station. Okay, so the technology tech. screen is where we will be directing our research. Please be quiet. Research speed. Um, let's go for... I don't know. Let's go for the farming subsidies. And let's go for... Let's go for plus 5% minerals at the moment. How is Earth looking? Here we see a visual representation of this planet. Please go away. Earth is looking okay. We have some enslaved populations. Fantastic. It's just what we like to see. I have a small fleet. And do I need a colony then? Is there any colonizable planets here? It tells me, doesn't it? Okay, let's just make a start to the Empire of Man. I appear to be a reddish colour. Slightly pink, maybe? We're okay with that, though. I'm trying to think, is there anything else I'm supposed to be doing right now? There probably is. Okay, let's go fast. Survey some systems. Should I potentially get... This is our system, Starbase. Oh, please go away. Should I potentially get... I'm a, a Mick Campbell class. I love it. Crown Prince Vladimir Hasberg is the new heir to our empire and will take to the throne. Fantastic. Habsburgs, very appropriate. Military fleets are used to protect our emerging empire from threat. The leaders tab lets us hire. Oh yes, I need to hire a leader. Oh no, we've got a leader. Why can't we build a uh, science ship? I always thought I could build a science ship. This has changed as well. I don't know what's going on here. Construction complete. What does this do? That seems pretty good. Construction complete. Okay, so we have built a new mineral place. If we can... Okay, there's already a mining station there. If we can build a mining station there. To be fair, the soul system's got some decent start points. I know there's all sorts of new alien features and so forth in the game. We'll read them out. So we don't have much of a fleet to talk of right now, do we? Sure again, it's fine. The question is, do we want to start building a fleet? Anomaly know. found. Okay, atmospheric readings from Alpha Centauri do not match simulated projections. Well, research. I'm very intrigued. Earth. Should I be building anything right now? Food, maybe? 
Some buildings may cause adjacency. Okay. Why do I have slaves already? The species screen lists all types of nominally. In I don't don't know why I have slaves already. It's okay though. We're not a judgmental people. Okay. They're potentially habitable planets. Okay, that's good. It's Alpha Centauri after all. I quite like where I am. I like being either on the outer edge, but because this is a big middle area, I think that's quite, quite interesting. I died quite quickly. I think I only lasted about four episodes. <sighs> She's failed. Amazing. Construction complete. Okay, UNS Mekong. If we can go, if we can go there to begin with. Oh no. Oh, no. Actually, yes. I don't need the research points at the moment. It could be beneficial, actually. I do have that extra four credits. What am I doing here? Come on. Get with it. Get with the program. Okay, can I need to... Let's go build a research station up there, shall we? So we have the star base. We have... Oh, we haven't even built this trading hub yet. I really hope that gives us four credits. It doesn't Construction cost. complete. It doesn't. It's it actually really good. Scientists. She's gained a level. She's gained experience gain. It's always good. I suppose we don't really want to. Let's put on fastest at the moment. The Ute Empire. We have recovered artifacts from an ancient civilization on Alpha Centauri 1. Our scientists think they inhabited this region of stars roughly six million years ago, based on the age of the artifacts. The aliens called themselves the Ute and appear to have been very large and flat amphipod analogues. It seems a single individual could reach a length of nearly a hundred meters as an adult, and it was apparently exceedingly rare for more than two or three Ute to travel aboard the same starship. Makes sense. Situation log updated. Thank you very much. One of our science ships has just surveyed a world that would make an excellent candidate for our first Fantastic. colony. It is of the same planet class as our home world, so our colonists should be quite... Com you are quite annoying. The Empire Man is a buzz. Well, I'm really pleased about the that. The government screen presents... But how the hell do I build a colony ship? I feel like I'm being a bit stupid here. If you can... Go build a research station. Just get that over with, please. I need to build. The spaceport tab is where we view orbiting fleets and build new civilian ships. I Military know. ships can only be. I mean, it's, I'm such an idiot. I'm only looking at the starship, of course. The starport. Okay, so let's System save up the money. Complete. Construction complete. Let us send you. Actually, let's do the ones right next to us first. Okay, so we need a fair whack of money. Got an active building, that's absolutely fine if we can move there. Why are you enslaved? This population is owned by the state. <laughs> Why? This is where we manage all ground. We should... Okay. So we're going to save up for that colony ship, shouldn't be too long. Let's take our construction ship to Alpha Sindori. There's some good stuff down there. Move here, please. System survey complete. Well, that was quick. Survey that system. I do have full empires on. I think it's 30. And a couple of fallen empires and a couple of advanced empires. And I also have it on random, however, though not clustered. Because I think that makes it more entertaining. And to be honest, more in my, my roleplay type nature as well. Okay, spaceport. Evading hostile fleet. Okay, we've got a hostile fleet. We have encountered some aliens. Okay, we'll have a look in a second. These are unknown space bearing entities. We can learn more about them and maybe even initiate first contact by completing the appropriate special project. Wow, those guys are amazing. Can I get them on my team? I can actually. 
Okay, we're getting a colony ship. Okay, so you ignore that system just now. We'll survey that one. Starbase. The tradition screen displays the tradition. So we are all about expansion and military. We'll start off with expansion, I think. Okay. 45. Okay, so I would like some more minerals, please. So if you can. Oh, we can't build there yet, can we? Until we've got the colony ship, of course. Okay, Sol Station. Let's get another Corvette, please. Thank you very much. Last time when I played this, I did not get enough military quickly. Habitable worm survey. We know without a doubt that a thriving biosphere is not something unique to Earth. Both the scientific community and the public at large are eager to learn more about the various forms of alien life found throughout the galaxy. Efforts to catalogue the life forms we encounter are already underway, but our xenobiologists have urged us to focus our planetary survey efforts on habitable life-bearing worlds. Yes. Construction complete. System surveyed, thank you very much. I think I'm just going to stick with one science vessel at the moment. I usually always get two, but I think we will. <laughs> Are you going to join up? Come on now. No reason you should merge. Construction complete. Okay. How do we merge? There we go. And we now have the UNS Australia. Which is a great name. Alpha Centauri. Wait, what? I can only call this. Why would I not be able to colonise that? That seems strange. You can only colonise planets within your borders. So... I need to build an outpost first, is that what they're telling me? That System survey complete. Okay, research speed. laser. I am going to be deliberately military focused. I am the Empire of Man and I do intend to expand. I don't really understand how this now works though, to be honest. So I need to build an outpost. Construction complete. And that is now in my, my land, correct? Okay. Colony ship. Go colonize Alpha Centauri for me, please. Why are you not colonizing? Anomaly found. Research, please. Uh, put that there. Alpha Centauri Prime is absolutely fine. If we can get you here, because that is a very nice show again. Chip, thank you very much. We are losing credits at an alarming. We're losing Congratulations credits. on having colonized the new world. What do you mean Our we're colonists. Credits? What's happening? I don't know what's going on. Ancient survey marker. A small short range transmitter has been located on the surface of Estev of Estevum 6. It appears to be an ancient survey marker placed here eons ago to mark a large deposit of precious metals. So how come I was losing money? Or was I not and it was just lying? It was just lying. Construction complete. So I need to clear some areas here I think. Okay, construction complete. I'm gonna need some more energy. There are only twos but let's do it. Can we get rid of um Can we get rid of you? I'd like to destroy you to be honest. Research complete. 
Okay, so I need to Tile blocker cleared. dismantle that after it's been colonized. Makes sense. Uh, coil gun shoot. I am now making no money. Construction though. complete. Okay, if you can go to Alpha Centauri 7. System survey complete. Okay, sound ship. Survey system. Doesn't take too long to colonize, which is nice. I understand, so colonies are, the colony is costing me money or energy credits. Change these later, I believe. Construction complete. Okay, she's getting better. Good. Oh, an Alpha Centauri. Anomaly so, found. We're receiving a weak signal from the surface. Let's research it. What does the planet look like? Might it be a industrial civilization? I think that would be obvious for us. A small short range transmitter has been located on the surface. Appears to be an ancient survey mast. Fantastic. Construction complete. The situation log displays a list I of all currently available space. special proof. Yes, okay, USN US people. United. What are you? Okay, come on. I suppose we'll get this last research point as well. The colony's almost done. Construction complete. Okay, that's a building. Yeah, that's not a problem. We can go there though. System survey complete. I'm so proud to be colonizing Alpha Centauri for the Empire of Man now. My Empress will be proud. Construction complete. So can I not build here? Okay, build a star base. As soon as that stop colonizing, we'll dismantle our other one. Special project complete. The entities encountered by our fleet some time ago are space-borne forms of life, quickly nicknamed Space Amoeba. Following a tactician's gross misreading of initial sensor output, the creature is in fact larger than the average human corvette. The creature displays aggressive behaviour towards human ships, but further study is warranted. For example, we could exercise our martial prowess by swiftly executing this specimen and studying its remains. No. We want to study them. Situation log updated. Let's research it, please. I'm very interested in weaponizing these System creatures. survey complete. I'm glad we have not found any other intelligent life so far, or majorly intelligent life, I suppose. Conditions available. Okay. Starbase info capital buildings now produce one additional unity. Yeah, let's do that. Construction complete. Okay, so you have built. Another star base. Or an outpost anyway. Okay, if you start off by building a mining station there. And these are some reasonable planets actually. We need to progress the Empire of Man scientifically ahead of any other species that may exist. It's probably worthwhile building another corvette just now. Alpha Centauri has now construction built. complete. That's about to build. Fantastic. So all of a sudden we're making money. And I would like to 
the same boat. Dismantle. Oh, I can't. Fair enough. Construction complete. So, the surface world. Let us build power plant there. Let's go to you. Let us build anomaly found. Station efforts to map the surface of this planet have identified the strange mountain formation to the southern hemisphere. It does not appear to have formed naturally. Let's have a look. Alien mountain ranges. It's always quite interesting. How's our research going? Obviously that one's been stalling for a while. Gigantic skeleton. What was previously thought to be assaulted mountains in the southern hemisphere of Kardroth IV have been identified as the massive skeletal remains of a single colossal alien life form. The bones have been dated as 3.4 billion years old, but our scientists have ruled out that Kardov IV could have supported life on that scale at any point in the planet's history. Science officer Najesta Krishna has prepared a special research project to delve further into Situation the Situation log updated. It's actually very interesting. System survey now. complete. Oh, space amoebas. The name has struck as the pronunciation of the proper xenotaxonic denominator is too unwieldy for the average human. Our solitary animals, when left to their own devices, all but the strongest, sorry, all but the youngest specimens are accompanied by quasi-independent flagella, organisms spawned by the amoeba and programmed through liquid RNA-laced secretions to do the bidding of the host. These flagella are capable of manipulating and even attacking objects at an impressive yet restricted range around the host periodically returning to the lodge inside the host amoeba's body for reprogramming. There are potential military applications of this graceful patterns of circulation. I agree. I absolutely agree. Cosmic Ray Catalyst Modifier Energy Credits plus 5%. It's quite nice. Okay, I think Construction we will actually complete. go to the... Orbit. A research project, fantastic. Okay, if we can get you down here, let us get you. It's too small, I can't click on it. Build the research station there. Continental Earth. Construction complete. Okay, let's build something here. Let's research complete. Science lab. We have research farming subsidies. New research, let us. Yes, let's do monthly unity. Can we upgrade this, for example? Yes, but we need a little bit more money. More minerals, I should say. Okay. Let us merge our wonderful fleets together. Once again, I'm pressing the wrong button. We definitely want to militarize. Construction complete. Special project completed. After continued studies of the massive skeletal remains found on Cardoff IV, Cardoff IV, Cardoff IV, science officer Nadeshta Grishna has concluded that the creature served as some kind of organic starship. Much smaller bones from at least three separate species were found within the larger skeleton, and we assume these came from members of the crew. For unknown reasons, this organic starship suffered catastrophic damage and crash landed on Cardoff IV. While we cannot begin to understand the biological engineering necessary to grow a starship like this, the study of these bones alone have substantially advanced our knowledge. Fantastic. Piece of that. Good job. Okay, and I suppose you may as well get the last mineral here as well. Let's go to Alpha Centauri. We won't bother building anything there just now. Can we do anything here? We need to upgrade it to do anything. Which I believe we will, because that energy credit is no joke. Fantastic. Earth is looking strong. Is there any edicts that we should potentially These do? These are planet specific nope. construction complete. Okay, we have completed construction on our home planet. And a summary surface. We can upgrade our farm. 
Can we upgrade our fleet at all? No upgrades available. Research. Leader is gained. Fantastic. Oh, that's actually very good, Governor. System survey complete. Okay. If I could go to card off, that does look like an interesting amount of minerals. So, if we take one here and we go build star base, please. That would complete. I would really like to uh, get some larger ships, but I don't think we'll make it in this episode. So, the shipyard, I would need to. It's these modules. Isn't Anomaly it? found. Soy. Three seems to exhibit one and only one interest in geological feature. Why are you so suspicious and tell me this, Najisha? Research it, please. Construction complete. Okay, Elf is finished. Yeah, let's go upgrade that as well. Thank you very much. And if we can clear. And if we can also clear. Construction complete. Thank you very much. Farah Geological Survey of Soy 3 by the UNS Sagan reveals nothing of interest. In fact, it is extraordinarily uninteresting. His only defining feature is his lack of defining features. There are depressions and elevations, yes, but on the whole, the surface of Soy 3 can be regarded as unnaturally flat. Likewise, the native flora and fauna are strikingly docile and unworthy of attention. Well, Jesus Christ, that's a bit harsh. The Empire of Man does like adventure, but at the same time, we don't needlessly mock people. Please learn this, Najisha. Got a nice research boost. Slave rallies on Earth, clandestine slave meetings at night, and raised levels of defiance towards superiors are missing good. Can only mean one thing the slaves on Earth are radicalizing, spreading sin and discord among their peers, and fear to the rest of the population. Whatever they're up to, it can't be good. Can I just stop my slaves then? Can I release you? In the contact screen, I want to see my policies. The policies tab covers government policies as well as empire wide edicts, Slavery. practices that can be enforced by spending some of our resources. Farming subsidies, information quarantine. Do. Okay, Najisha is getting very good actually. Okay, do you need to build anything? Research really? complete. We will build a farm here though, just in case. Okay, research complete. We've got a blue laser technology. We would like to go for this. We can now upgrade. Okay, there's a handy little upgrade reminder there. Let us upgrade that fleet. Ships upgraded. Okay, didn't really do anything. System survey complete. Let me build another corvette as well. Okay, let's survey this system. If you can build a corvette on the next turn, fantastic. Traditions available. New life awaits us. The effect of increased addition. Okay, so there is no better indicator. I think we will go for supremacy now as well. It might be a bad idea to go for more than one at a time. Oh, star base up. Let's go for supremacy though. <coughs> Excuse me. So the Empire Man has grown, however, it's certainly not grown as much as I would want. We need to be more. Expansion Construction system. complete. Hasn't been a huge amount of habitable worlds at the moment, which is a little frustrating. If you can build a mining station here, thank you very much. We have plenty of food. Construction yeah, complete. More storage. Okay, you Evading hostile fleet. Oh, we've encountered some form of alien vessels in Sabua. These strange options have been flagged as kelpies. Till we can learn. Oh, kelpies from Scottish mythology. Let us go for standardised corvette and let us see this. Oh dear. Oh dearie me. 
Are these actually vessels? Tile blocker cleared. And if the building's not a problem. You can move there. Fine. Let us build another hydroponic farm. Let us build. Maybe we'll go for the monument actually. Construction complete. Construction complete. Fantastic. If we can get you. Go for more minerals, please. We can upgrade you now as well. Ships upgraded. We are getting a little bit better. Which is very good. Okay guys, I think we're gonna have to call it for this episode for the Empire of Man. Let's just have a little think of what our next expansion is going to be. Empire Man for a fantastic symbol. I may go and take out those alien creatures, although I was kind of hoping to do something with them. We're going to move to Sulu, or Soy. Soy, even, because there's lots of energy here, so we'll expand that way. We may have to actually research terraforming. We will send our survey vessel north after this, however, and there may be some closer-to-home vessels doing okay we've not discovered any other true intelligent life but the empire of man will continue to grow and dominate so do remember to hit that like button subscribe if you've not already and leave a comment i'll see you for the next one